So Jesus is warning us that there are plenty of people that come and they sound good. They sound like their message is good. It, it tickles the ear. It, it makes it, us feel good as we listen to what they have to say. They come, they're wolves, but they come in sheep's clothing as if their message is bringing us goodness and health. All you have to do is watch the news and be, be part of the social media to find out all this good news, quote-unquote, that's being told to us about our freedoms. And yet, he says, don't judge just by the initial, but go and look and see what fruit is it bearing. Is this good or is this not? And for our own lives as Christians, we can look and say, is this drawing me closer to Almighty God in my life? Or is this luring me away from Him, from following Him and His love? We can then also then turn this in on ourselves and look and say, am I being a good witness to Christ? Am I bearing good fruit? And what are the good fruit that we need to bear? Well, St. Paul tells us in the letter to the Galatians, love, joy, peace, patience. You know, you've heard them before, the fruit of the Spirit. And so we need to ask God to help us to examine ourselves. Are we bearing good fruit? Are we growing in love and joy and peace and patience and goodness and kindness, all those things? Or are we not? And if we're not bearing the good fruit, okay, we need to say, okay, God, there's something going on inside of me. Help me to change. Help me to, to be able to be that good tree that bears good fruit so that I can be a witness of your love to every person that I meet.